Hey, I'm Roland with Mobile Geeks and we're right here at Computex 2013 and we're at the booth of Quanta which is like the biggest uh, contract manufacturer for notebooks and they're doing tablets nowadays too um, because the trend is going towards tablets, right? Um, so this right here is an 11.6 inch device from Quanta. It's a prototype device so it's a reference design that Quanta wants to sell to other companies who want to might use it as their platform. So it just goes to show off what they can do. And this, what's special about this is basically that it's an AMD system. It's based on the new Temash AMD A4 1200 CPU. That's a dual core running at one at just one gigahertz. It's got an integrated AMD Radeon graphics part, which is pretty powerful since it's capable of running this device at a full HD resolution. So the screen is actually a 1920 by 1080p resolution screen. Looks like an IPS panel from what I can tell. So the viewing angles are totally all right. As you can see, um, the device itself is pretty light. It's a reference design, so it might get thicker and heavier if you put in bigger batteries. I think this device should last about six hours at least, power-wise. And yeah, it's basically a cheap Windows 8 tablet with a high resolution screen. So these devices should be available with 3066 by 768 resolution screens as of about $300 or 300 euros. Um, with higher resolutions, it's probably gonna be more expensive. Um, yeah, the performance seems all right for this just dual core CPU. I just opened a couple of apps and the flipping stuff works pretty nice. The load times are all right. Um, what they did here is they pimped it all the way, so it's got this high resolution screen and it's got a huge SSD in there, at least for this kind of device. I think that should be a 120 gig SSD, it might even be a normal hard drive, but they couldn't tell me about that. Um, let's take a quick look around, up here we have just a normal webcam, it should be a 1.3 or 2 megapixel webcam. On the left, as I said, it's a demo device or a prototype device, so they put pretty much everything in there they got. So this is a SIM card slot up here, so you probably can order this with LTE or 3G or whatever you want, as they're only selling to other companies that might want to sell them under their own brand name. We have a micro SD card slot right there. This is the headset jack, micro HDMI out. This is like a blind spot. There's like nothing behind the, these two holes. I think that's a mic. They might be hiding the mics behind that. Here, down here, we have a capacitive touch button. And on the bottom, there's pretty much nothing at all. And on the right side, we have two more of these holes, <laughs> about which I don't know what they are. This right here is a docking port, actually, so you can plug it into a docking station and charge it. Uh, or uh, put more juice in it, so they might even be able to overclock the CPU, depending on what you do with it. It's this elite mobility concept from AMD, where they actually overclock the CPU when you put it in the docking station. Um, right next to it, we have a power LED and a power plug, and a screen rotation hold button, or like a hold switch, and the volume rocker right there. Um, on the back we have just a normal webcam or basically it should be like a 3 or 5 megapixel camera and right next to that is something that looks like a LED flash but I don't think there's anything like that in there. Um, there's the name of the company, it's called Quanta and as I said it's the biggest contract manufacturer for tablets and, or not for tablets but for notebooks. Um, I was rolling with Mobile Geeks, see you later. Bye.